Hi, I'm Mike Meyer, and here we go with the crackle. This is Alpha Acrylic water-based paint. I'm using my Mac Meyer number 12 mop. Now, when you put it on, putting it on sparingly or fast, just kind of a little more on top than the bottom because that's where the painter would have had the most paint on his brush starting it. But the main thing is to get your edges so it looks like a professionally done sign that's just really aged. That's what we're after here is to crack a look. 40. So there you go. That's about all you need. So we're going to start our crackle. Just get Elmer's glue, school glue, pour it into a tuna cup. Get a big old brush, something that's a throwaway, and just sporadically put it on, any old way, thick or thin. If you want bigger cracks, put on a lot. If you don't want as much, put it on very thin. I just put it anywhere, sporadic. And then we're going to wait. About 20 minutes for this to dry. And then we're going to put our matte top coat on it from Alpha Acrylic. 20 minutes, now it's time to put our Alpha Acrylic matte top coat on it. You can put gloss on it, but I prefer matte so it's flat. Pour it into another cup. Sporadically, just like before with the glue. Put it over the top. Any old way. What's happening is the glue dries different than the top coat, therefore it cracks. That's what gives you the effect. So, this will be about an hour, maybe more. We'll start to see the cracks. This dries clear, then you have to rub in a darker color or lighter so you can see the cracks. Our piece is all dried. Got some acrylic paint, a little bit of water, and a sponge. What I'm doing is I'm going to rub it into the cracks. Then you can start to see the texture. You can apply this as thick as you'd like. See how there was a lot more glue there? If you want to take some away, just get some water. And you can move it away. Like that. Or a little more. That's it. Sponge is, the, sponge is the best part because otherwise a rag you just don't get it.